Do you experience clicking in your knee while running? Is it possible that this clicking could lead to arthritis and inflammation in the knee? Stay tuned to find out. Hi, this is Mark Robinson. I'm a physical therapist. You might have seen some of my articles on Competitor Running Magazine, which is now PodiumRunner.com. A common question that people have is about clicking in the knee while running. They wanna know if it's causing any harm and damage to the knee. Plus, it's so annoying. So why does this happen? Well, to answer the first question, it's usually not harmful. If it's not causing pain, then it's less likely to be causing inflammation and damage to the knee joint. It's actually very common. And one of the main reasons why this happens is because the patella, which is the kneecap, is not tracking properly on the femur. And one thing that you could try doing is you can use some tape and you can try gliding the patella medially. You push it inward and you can see if that reduces some of that clicking immediately. And if it does reduce the clicking, then that indicates that it might be because of your patellar tracking. Another reason why you could be getting clicking is having plica. An excessive plica in the knee, it's essentially extra tissue buildup, and that could sometimes get stuck, and that could lead to some clicking as well. If it's not painful, then it's usually not a big deal. Another reason why you could be getting clicking in the knee is from having a torn meniscus. A torn meniscus can get worse and that can lead to popping, clicking, catching, clunking in the knee joint. It's usually experienced along the joint line and it feels like it's deeper in the knee or in the back of the knee. Now if, now if this just continues and you don't get it checked, then the meniscus tear could get worse and this could lead to inflammation in the knee. So if you're experiencing some clicking, popping, and you have pain in the knee, especially when you're bearing weight on the knee, then you wanna get it checked by your doctor and an MRI will help to rule out a meniscus tear. If you feel clicking in the knee and you also notice an increase in pain or swelling, then you may have excessive inflammation in the knee joint. And if that's the case, then you wanna start doing exercises, stretching to reduce the pressures in the knee so you could reduce that inflammation. Initially, inflammation is good for healing. It's part of that natural healing process. But if it persists and lingers, then this becomes chronic inflammation. And this could actually be harmful to the cartilage that's in your knee. It could lead to more breakdown in the cartilage. So you wanna start doing different techniques to reduce inflammation. And strength training and exercise is one of the best things that you can do. You can start building up your hip strength. You can start stretching your quadriceps so you can reduce pressures into the knee joint. Another thing that you can try if your doctor approves is look into curcumin supplementation. There was a 2021 study that just came out and it showed that curcumin, when you take it in high doses, can reduce knee pain and improve physical function. And the benefits from curcumin were nearly equal as taking prescription anti-inflammatories. So that is a compelling argument for looking into taking a curcumin supplement. But when you're taking one, you need to make sure that you're gonna get the right dosage because many of these studies use between 500 and 2000 milligrams of curcumin extract per day to get those therapeutic benefits. I started Active Adams Turmeric because many of the turmeric products out in the market didn't have enough curcuminoids to reach a therapeutic level. Active Atoms is 15 times stronger than many turmeric products that are out on the market today. And as a reminder, for every bottle purchased, we donate to Rescue Freedom, which is a nonprofit helping women and children in India who are victims of sex trafficking. So please support our mission to help people move and live with total freedom.